On receipt of a verbal command to mark time, the band shall do so as for standard foot drill. The visual signal to mark time is the same as for stepping off. Bands will not normally be signaled to commence marking time from the halt unless prearranged. Assuming the band is marching in quick time, bring your mace to the carry position. As your right foot goes forward, cut your right arm to the side and at the same time, your left hand is brought to cover the belt buckle. Working on consecutive left feet, your right hand is extended down to grasp the staff just below the midway point. Raise your mace with both hands horizontally, to chin level. Your left hand reversed to grasp the staff near its head so that both your palms are to the front, with your fingers curled over the staff. After a pause, the horizontal mace is raised above your head, with your arms fully extended. The drummer shall play a cautionary double tap on a left foot beat, a signal for all band members to look at the drum major's signal. After a slight preparatory movement of the raised mace, bring your horizontal mace down to shoulder level on the next left foot. Band members take a check pace with the right foot, then a half step with the left foot, and then bring the right foot into the left in a straight-legged manner, not scraping the ground, and commence marking time on the next left foot. When marching in quick time without playing, musicians simultaneously cut their disengaged arm to the side. On the next left foot, band members commence marking time, bending the left knee as in standard foot drill and in tempo with music being played, and on the following left foot beat, bring the mace to the carry position. When marking time, your mace is at the carry position. If marking time for only a short period of time before stepping off again, your mace can remain at chin level before being raised again in preparation for the step-off signal.